In this video, we will be going over the subtraction strategy of counting back on a number line. Counting back is a handy strategy to use when we only have to subtract a small number, and number lines can help us do this. We want to use strategies that get us the correct answer, but also get us the correct answer quickly. So we wouldn't use this strategy when we're subtracting a bigger number. So if we had 50 minus 32, counting back on a number line would not be the best strategy. When we have minus 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, even 9, using a number line is a pretty quick strategy. And if you learn how to do it properly, it can get you the correct answer. So let's try one together. Remember, that when we use this strategy, we want to start at the biggest number. Let's start with 46 minus 3. I'm going to get a pen to help me with this. 46. I'm going to count back one jump, two jumps, three jumps. My third jump landed me at 43. So 46 minus 3 equals 43. Let's try another one. 50 minus 2. Start at 50, count back 1, 2. I landed at 48. That's my answer. 19 minus 4. Start at 19, count 1, 2, 3, 4. This number is how many jumps I should have. I have 1, 2, three, four jumps. I landed on 15. 19 minus 4 is 15. 34 minus 5. Start at 34. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 34 minus 5 is 29. Now, sometimes you'll want to have um, a larger number to start with, and using a meter stick can be good, but you may also want to print out or create a number line that looks like something like this. And this is good as long as you know how to use it correctly. So let's try one together. 64 minus 5. Start at 64. One jumps. Two jumps. Three. Now my fourth jump is actually going to be all the way here, five. So I jumped one, two, three. This is my fourth jump, five. 64 minus five is 59. Let's try another one. 81 minus three. Start at 81. One jump. Two, three. Eighty-one minus three is seventy-eight. Seventy-six minus two. Sometimes you don't have to jump to the next line. Seventy-six, one, two, equals seventy-four. Seventy-six minus two, seventy-four. One hundred minus four. Start at one hundred. One. 2, 3, 4 equals 96. All right, it's your turn to try some subtraction questions on your own. Take a look and see if you have a number line that goes up to 30 and try the question 25 minus 2. Start at the 25, count two jumps back and see what number you land on. Good luck.